So this is a quick video on how to make a gradient follow a long a path, so from purple to blue in this case, instead of like this sweeping layover right here. So if you want to use the paintbrush tool and make a path by freehand, there's a little trick you need to know before you can apply this effect. But first, let's start off with the pen tool. So the pen tool, the line tool and the geometric tools all work the same way when it comes to applying this effect. So let's grab the pen tool and create a path like this. Then let's make the stroke a little bit wider. And here we can apply the gradient. And as you can see right now, we have the default sweeping layover. So to make the gradient go from one color in one end to another color in the other end, we simply need to go to this gradient panel. And if it isn't open, you can find it in window and gradient right here. Then simply go to this button right here that says apply gradient a long stroke. And here we have the effect that we want. Unfortunately, to apply this effect to a path created with the paintbrush tool, for some reason there's another step we need to take before we can apply it. So now let's pick the paintbrush tool and once again let's create a path. Then let's select the path and make it bigger so we can see it. So as you can see right here, we have this default sweeping overlay again. And if we simply click this button again, nothing happens. And if you have a good explanation for this, please write it down in the comment section. Fortunately, the workaround is very simple. We simply need to go to the brush panel and instead of having one of these calligraphic brushes selected, you need to select one of these brushes right here or a brush you made yourself, which is not calligraphic. For this example, I will select the basic brush Bump it up just a little bit, just so you can see what I'm doing. And if you now go down to the gradient panel and click this apply gradient a long stroke, it will work perfectly. Thank you for watching.